Tell you what, Toby, I love the cowboy hat method. Skip Johnson uses. Well hit, straight away center field. Braden Daniel back. He's at the wall, and it's another Red Raider home run. A two-run shot to straightaway center field, and it's 2-0 Tech. Their eighth home run of the series, second for Fulford, and the 12th home run Tech has hit against OU pitching. Continue to stay hot. Fulford does a nice job of a mistake pitch over the middle of the plate. Elevates it. We're going to split them up. The offense has got to limit the strikeouts. We've got 26 in the past two games for the, the Oklahoma offense. And there's the first base hit of the series for Parker Kelly. It's headed up the alley. Extra bases. Kelly will cruise into second with a double. Look at his back toes. And he hits one hard to center field. Watch out. Braden Daniel runs out of room again, and that's over the batter's eye. A three-run home run makes it 5 nothing Red Raiders. Oklahoma cannot keep these guys in the park. That's to center field and deep. Braden Daniel turned around. Unbelievable. I mean, unbelievable. It's the third home run of the day. All of them to the same spot. Straight away center field, and it's 6 nothing. Third home run of the inning. I think there's a hole in the batter's eye, Toby. Those balls were just rocketed. And he wins the battle. Montgomery strikes out McKenna. Second strikeout for Montgomery. I'm not arguing with Mr. Cordell. Strikes out Zaragoza. They've got a good hitting ball club. A lot of power throughout that lineup. Base hit Fulford into center field. I mean, everything's right back up the middle. It's not down at the ankles, but it's also not at the knees baker takes a big lead on carter easton morrell hits it hard to right and he stares it down and that's another home run for tech they get the run back and some it's now eight to one wow fourth home run of the day 11th of the series 15th against OU this year. Goes and he down. gave it a long look. <laughs> wow. He just goes down and gets that ball, man. And the fourth home run of the year for Morrell. Texas Tech hit four home runs out in Amarillo. Four home runs here Friday night. Three yesterday. Four so far today. Cole Stillwell homered his last time up. And he hits it hard into left. Big turn by Young, then he slams on the brakes. And the first four have reached for the Red Raiders here in the fourth. Then again, they're good two strike hitters. They're good one strike hitters. I imagine he'll find a way to. I mean, this is remarkable, folks. A three run home run by Cal Conley. And it's 11 to 1. The fifth home run of the game for Texas Tech. Tonight, dodging the raindrops. And the first pitch is slammed into left field by Brandon Zarek. Goes in a diving catch made by Drew Baker. What else? On senior day, that's just plain rude. One out. You know, he didn't feel like he was doing his, his job at the plate, so he failed, he, he kind of had to pick it up on the defensive side. Z hits this ball really hard. Baker gets a great jump on it, full extension. That thing almost hits the ground. Nice play, Mr. Baker. Have a weekend, man. Slow chopper toward first. Dive for the bag, and he's out. Tagged on the hip. 
Nice play by Cole Stillwell. What? Ah. Connor McKenna diving stop. Parker Kelly up. Threw him out. 12 standing wise, weren't they? Fly ball deep center field. Braden Daniel back to the warning track. It's over his head as he crashes into the wall. Extra bases for Masters. He's going into third, and he's there with a triple. Tyler Hartman's hitting 396 after that last double. Wild pitch to the screen. Here comes Masters, and it's 12 to 1. Off the end of the bat, fair ball. Fulford into second with a stand-up double. Excuse me, faced three batters. Retired two out of three. Line drive, left center field. That's going to get down. It'll score a run. Digging for second, Dylan Carter, an RBI double. And it's 13 to 1. Unbelievable. <laughs> I mean, it's that kind of weekend, folks. Brandon Zaragoza robbed now twice today. What a play at third. Parker Kelly. Could be two. The flip to second for one, the throw to first. 6-4-3. Bases juice, two outs, the 2-2. Two, two. Popped up, right side, foul territory. Playable. And the ball game is over. Cole Stillwell with the grab in front of the Texas Tech dugout. And that's a run rule victory for the Red Raiders in seven innings on Sunday. They win it 13-2.